More rain is falling across southern and central England with serious flooding bringing misery to many communities after days of extreme weather. More than 800 homes have been flooded with Devon and Cornwall particularly hard hit. Andy Moore has the latest. With many parts of the country already underwater, what is needed is a dry spell. We won't be getting it, at least not in the short term. There's a warning today of heavy rain in many areas, up to 70 millimetres, that's nearly three inches, in parts of the northeast. This pub in Somerset has been surrounded by water since Wednesday, and despite all the best precautions, it's been impossible to keep the floods out. Some people seem to have no problem getting through the floodwaters, but drivers are being urged to exercise extreme care. The motoring organisations have been dealing with hundreds of cases of flooded engines. Rail services in the southwest are experiencing severe disruption. Elsewhere across the country, many roads are still flooded, and that will make this morning's journey to work a challenge. <laughs> Areas of southern Britain have been lashed by heavy rain and high winds. One woman was killed in Devon when she was hit by a falling tree. In parts of southwest England, rail services have been affected with delays and cancellations. Road travel has been treacherous. Forecasters have warned that further rain and high winds are expected in the coming days. The Environment Agency saying 800 homes were underwater nationally. Some 70,000 more are at risk. This morning, nearly 300 flood warnings were in place in England and Wales. The further two flood alerts in Scotland. The main message is if they, are, if they know this is coming is to just get whatever personal property they've got to as high a po uh, point in their house as they can. Make sure there's nothing going to be affected in terms of electrics or the water and just stay as safe as possible and if we're needed, call us. The weather front, which brought heavy rain and devastation to southern England, is now moving north. Motorists are being told to take extra care during this morning's rush hour as many roads remain closed due to surface water. We're going to see an enormous volume of work coming in. A lot of people travelling to and from work. Um, that's really the problem we're going to have is getting around to the people because of the amount of traffic on the roads, the amount of roads that are blocked because of flood water. From Cornwall to Teesside, people are expecting yet more rain, hoping that the flood defences already in place will work, but preparing for the worst.